Black History Culture and Arts Festival. So we try to highlight artists that are tradition bearers. Uh, we have artifacts out that kids and families can learn from. We have our projects going on in the classroom. And we do uh, a full day of this. Uh, it's free um, every time. We're doing this show called Tiara's Hat Parade, and it is based on a children's book by Kelly Starling Lyons. Uh, it's about a young girl whose mother is a milliner, and their uh, family business goes out of business due to gentrification. And it's about the family uh, rediscovering their love for their craft and uh, coming together to support one another in a difficult time. We take the book, and every word from the children's book is put into our play and it's like bringing the story to life. The Rhapsody Project is a non-profit organization that focuses on heritage and music and uh, um, bringing forth the her your heritage through an anti-racist lens. It teaches a different way of music and focusing on more of the, your heritage and how it, how it comes through in music and how it sh how it's shared and how we can share it through a very different light. I like this event because I get to learn about African American music and jazz. The Puyallup School District community believes that the diversity of all folks helps to create a great society where the influences of those cultures come together to enhance all of us. Good.